So up here we have the laptop connecting to your current wireless router, which goes out to the internet. Simple enough. We also have a GoPro, and we have a wireless router with DDWRT on it. What we're going to do is we're going to change DDWRT to connect wirelessly to the GoPro. We're then going to connect a cable back to the, the router, the main router. So therefore, it will work this way. Now, this, the default IP address of the GoPro is 10.5.5.9. Now, some of these other addresses are going to change depending on your setup, but most of them, this will be 192.168. Dot one dot one. Again, it could be zero, it could be whatever you have it set as. This one we're going to make this side of it 192.168.1. For this example, on this paper, we'll say two, and we're going to create a static route. And that's it. All right, so now that that's all out of the way, I already got my wireless turned off. I'm gonna plug the router in. And let's just make sure. Okay. So it's gonna pull an address automatically. I'm gonna change, just for this demonstration, I'm gonna change it to just root for everything. Okay, so first thing, go to status, go to wireless. You want to go to site survey. At this point, you want to make sure your uh, GoPro is turned on because we're going to connect to it. It's right here. That's what I call it. And it looks good. We're going to save. Go to wireless client. Go to wireless security. Go to WPA2 personal. GoPros use AES, at least the three does. And now you want to put in your uh, your passphrase for the for the GoPros wireless. Hit save, and then apply. Now at this the point, GoPros going or the um, access point is going to reset. So you can get a status wireless and just wait for the GoPro to show back up there it could take a minute or two there it is so it's now connected to the GoPro which is actually the one I'm using to record this video so I got to be careful I don't knock it off uh, so you want to go back to setup and remember this is on the wireless bridge the the second wireless router we want to change that to a static IP. Now, if you have nothing but zeros here, means that uh, the access point isn't connecting properly to the GoPro. You want to go back to your wireless settings, make sure you got the passphrase set in and all that properly. But if you have an IP address, just leave it if you want, you can set it to DH. Eh. Let me think about that for a second. Yeah, you can, you can use it. Leave it on DHCP if you want. Either way, I'm gonna call this GoPro Bridge. You can tell I've already done this before, and we're gonna change the IP address now. This is gonna be the local IP address because the WAN is actually wireless or the wireless. The LAN is going to be the, the physical connection. And we want to match the network. Now, the network I'm using is a dot two. So I get to find an IP address that's not being used on the network. Well, I happen to know that just about none of them are being used. And I'm going to make that dot five. Yours is going to might be dot one, dot five, dot one, dot whatever you want to make it. You got to know that for your own network. Disable the DHCP server, hit save, 
So the address of this access point or this router is 2.5. So let's remember that. Now it's rebooting. Now's the time to grab this, unplug it, and plug it into the back of your router. Wait till it's done rebooting first. Um, and you're not going to see it because it's going to be a new address, but just watch the lights on the front of it. Once they've all shut off and come back on again, then it's safe to unplug it, plug it in the back of your router, and then turn your wireless back on and connect to your main router. So I got that plugged in to the main router. I'm going to turn this back on. The wireless is now back on, and it's now connected to the main router. So I should be able to go to Google. So I'm going to go to the main router. And this is the one that I get internet from. You want to go to setup and advanced routing. And we're going to create a static route. Now, as you can see, I've already done this. You can call the route name whatever you want, just so you know what it is. We're going to do the destination LAN network address is going to be the address of the GoPro. The subnet mask is all going to be 255 because we only want it to go to that address. And the gateway is going to be the address of the second router, the second wireless router that we just installed. Save that and apply settings. And now that that's done, you're pretty much good to go. And I'll show you, I'm on the internet. And at the same time, uh, we can 5.5.9, we can ping the GoPro, which is right here. I also have this program that I use called Camera Suite. It's excellent. And I'll leave the link down below, but essentially it lets you control the GoPro from a computer. So there's all the settings. It's in the middle of recording, so I can't change anything. And you can see it's turned on. Status, everything's there. Let's see if we can do a live preview of what it's recording. Yep, so there's the live preview. It's a little delayed. And uh, so that's it. If you have any questions or comments or anything, please leave them in the comments down below. And um, I hope this helped.